What you're looking at here is the city's latest and most expensive flood defense system yet. A $7 billion mechanized barrier called Mose that promised salvation from a watery fate. After decades of controversy and planning, it finally began operating in 2020. Here's how it's supposed to work. A series of 20 meter wide metal barriers have been strategically placed around the lagoon's inlets. They sit in huge concrete casins that were prefabricated on land, then dropped into trenches on the seabed. Each of these massive concrete segments features a service tunnel that all connects back to land, allowing access for inspections. When not in use, the hollow barriers are filled with water and submerged. But when a high tide is forecast, compressed air flows into the gates, pushing the water out. This causes the gates to rotate on their hinges and rise above the surface, blocking the incoming tide from entering the lagoon.